<laughs> mean, bro. Very nice, Kernard, bro. Hi, and welcome back to Muddy Feet. Today, I've loaded up the little old tinny and I'm heading out for a spontaneous Tauranga fishing session with my good mate, my brother from another mother, Nick the Netman Kevil. I'm not sure how today's going to unfold. It's a spontaneous mish, so let's see how it goes. Let's get amongst it. Brother has arrived. Let's see, brother. Let's go fishing. Nick's forgotten his life jacket, so I've tucked the boat in the water. I'm going to give it a little bit of a test run, and uh, bro will be back shortly. He's gone to the shop to buy himself a fresh one. Sorted. <laughs> Bro's got a life jacket. We're on. Need the rock, bro. There you go, TK Rock. The weather forecast for today was absolutely beautiful, so we shot out the entrance looking for a likely fishing spot. Starting to have a little bit of activity. I got smashed on the softy and had a bit of a missy tero. From the bro Nick, did it get eaten? Oh, bro Nick just got smashed on the bait. <laughs> so that's a pretty good sign. Yeah. Um, we've just come across a little bit of a scum line. So it's otherwise pretty featureless where we're fishing out here along the Matakana banks. But um, there's a tidal scum line where all the bubbles and things collect, sort of where the currents meet. And there's quite often a little bit of food um, coming out of that scum line that's sinking so you'll quite often find on big sandy patches when you come across the scum line you start to catch a few fish so um, if it goes quiet we're going to putter back up on the other side of it and drift through it again bro nick's hooked up to something looks like a kahi, kahi I think mean right. bro it's good fish too good size good work bro got no net today so you know um, probably need to swing it in, or I'll try and grab it for you bro, tire him out a bit more, he's a good size one. It's a big kahi too bro, shot, mean, great fish, well, well I reckon we definitely bleed him bro, because <laughs> we are in Tauranga. Our chances of catching a lot of fish today are pretty slim. Um, but we'll definitely take that beast, bro. 
beauty. Mean, bro. Bad on, eh? Not bad at You're all. Close to the surface on this, I think. True. It's awesome. Ooh, look up. Jay. Jay's on. Jay's on. Got the little dog. <laughs> right, he's coming home for dinner. Yeah, yeah, hardly off. Taste the size little kahawai. I'm gonna bleed them, chuck them on the ice, and turn this guy into a little bit of sashimi later on. Good little eater. Nothing big, but still delicious size. The dog. Yeah, next time. Woohoo! It's an acrobatic one. Hopefully, the slider's out of the way enough, eh? Just hooked into the boat, so he's green as. Yeah, bro. <laughs> mean, bro. Oh, this is good, having a bit of a kahawai session. Nothing wrong with a few fresh kahis. Bit of sashimi, maybe something for the smoker. It looks like a good size one, bro. He's better than my pinner. Oh, he's in the boat. Nice fish, bro. Another solid kahi. There's three kahawai for the bit. Mean. Alright, that's a few solid fish on the ice so far. Hopefully we can carry on two or three more of those. It'd be a mean feed, really. Yeah. Be pretty happy with another couple of those. Red one would be nice though. Yeah, a red one or a carrot would be nice. Red or orange. Yeah. We'll see. Ho hopefully we can get a few different flavours, but hey, if it's a car wise session, I'll still be happy. Biggest dumb That's right. It's hard to beat a bit of fresh kahi too, bro. Premium bait. Yeah, well, I am going to eat the other ones. Tashimi's on. Hey, he's got smack on the softy. Nice. Right on the bottom too, so... Oh, that might be, might be a red one. I'm hoping it's a red one. It feels like it's probably just big enough for a burger. <laughs> it is a red one. Nice. Oh, he's in the pot too. Yes. About a 33er. About a 33, 35. Beautiful little eating size snapper on the old glowing gurnard soft bait. It's my favorite color, that little glowing gurnard one. It's a primo soft bait. Awesome. Good stuff. Great color. It's a magic color for fishing, I reckon. Yeah. Orange and pink. Orange and pink, bro, 100%. My favourite kingy jigs a big pink bugger. Mm. Works real good. Little pink limo. Oh, true. True, bro. It's one of those ones where it got it on the top of my twitch, bro. Yeah, so I yeah. No yeah, yeah. It's right there. Something nice. Popped up again on the soft bait. Looks like another good red too. Yeah, I think so, bro. Right on the bottom again. I can hear David. Yeah. Man, I had a few hits there before I hooked that one, so it's pretty good. Yeah, another it's nice another one. red. Red coat on the fish. Not bad at all. A little bit bigger it's than the last one. It's a bit bigger than the last one. It'd be yeah, probably 36, 37 going yeah, that bro. one. Not bad at all. Yeah, Maybe I can just, fish. here comes the bro on the ski. Yeah. He's been working this morning. We've been out here since this morning. He's banging out. Hello, Dave. Just in time to see me catch my next burger. Yeah. Yeah. Perfect. Yeah, yeah, boy. Yeah, bro. Working from home, bro. <laughs> me too. <laughs> Yep. Oh yeah. Smacked. Nice. The old sandwich luck, bro. Every time. Bro, it's a real thing. 
sandwich like Right. Wonder what we got this time. Be a snappy, I imagine, eh? That's on that piece of kahawai bait, right? Yeah. Mean, bro. Good mahi. Oh, yeah, it's a nice fish, too, bro. Beautiful penny. Nice. Great fish, bro. It's, it's like a 40. Getting bigger. Getting bigger, bro. Well. If I don't pick up another fish on the old softy soon, I might jump over to a kahi bait as well. It's a nice sized fish. All right, nice eater, bro. Best this fish of the day so far. All right, give him a little a little poke in the eyebrow, and we'll pop him on the ice. Chill out, bruv. Bin's starting to look pretty good now. Sandwich luck could be on again straight away. Works so well, eh, bro? No, it's, it's a true thing. <laughs> it's a true story, eh? This is the scum line I was talking about. It's just where all the seaweed and bubbles and junk sort of collects, along with any food as well. Quite often collects and sort of falls out there, so you quite often find fish when you come across these scum lines. Maybe next time, eh? Yeah. Next hooked up on the little one. Hooked up on the fresh kahawai again, eh? Oh, bro, it's a nice carrot. Beautiful. You'll take that. Beauty, bro. Bonus. Grab my little spiky bits. <laughs> Very nice kernid, bro. It's got those trippy warts on it. Somebody in the comments let me know what those warts are. Yeah. I see these on some kernid, but I really don't know what it is. I still eat them. They taste all right. But uh, yeah, nice fish. Beautiful. Beautiful. Nice kernid, Nick. Woohoo. Bonus fish. They're hard to bro, but uh, what people do is they usually turn them over and stab them under there into the head. Because they're too hard. Shit, bin's looking good. Still looking good at hunt bro. Yeah. We'll take it, we'll take it. Another nice kawaii. I think one's gonna turn into some fresh sashimi or something for sure. It's a good size for sashimi. Yeah. That one. We'll be out here for dinners today, and that guy's in for sure, 100%. All right, a few good fish in the bin so far. We've got three nice snapper, three nice kahawai, and a fat gurnard. But the wind's picking up a little bit, and uh, we've got a few deadlines to meet this afternoon. So we're gonna cruise back in the harbour, see if we can catch a kahawai or two and uh, probably call it a day after that. Gee. Right, let's go. I'll hit Kahawai here. Soft, mate. Just saw some birds working as we came in the entrance here. So we just um, slowed down, moved over towards them, flicked a few softies, and well, bam! Got another nice fish for the table. Pretty cool to fish right up under the bridge, eh? Yeah, right here, eh? Yeah. 
Yeah, well, the white bait sort of slow down or hold up anywhere there's a bit of structure. Just they happen to go. Oh, I saw that big swirl. pretty good so we just stopped off by this busy little bridge here um, there was some birds working and uh, we managed to pick up another three bonus kahawai great way to polish off the trip yeah bro <laughs> it's gonna be so cool if you get one under there eh hook up under the bridge would be pretty gangster I still love going in little places like this, eh, bro? It never gets old. Ouch. Ouch. Just about broke my little toe. Ouch. No, I just kicked my rod holder. No, that's kahawai blood. <laughs> I'm all good. Yeah, mother. Cheer, brother. <laughs> Church to the chair, brother Nick. Main mission, bro. Look forward to the next one. Chip out. Right, we've both got uh, we've both got important appointments to get to, but that was an awesome, real quick session in Tauranga. We ended up with uh, three snapper and six kahawai, I think. But um, yeah, excellent little session. Hope you guys enjoyed this little episode, and uh, thank you for watching.